Reyerindos. 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 Ya? Okay. Say it again. Reyerindos. Reyerindos. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a very special guest with me, my mom. And we are going to be trying out different types of Mexican candy and ranking them one to 10. One being the absolute worst and 10 being the best. So are you ready for a sugar rush? I can wait. Okay. Let's do it. Let's get started. Reyeritos. Rayerindos. Uh, perfect. Really? Mm -hmm. Okay, so the first candy that we're going to try is called Rayerindos. Is that how you pronounce it? Yes, which is Rayerindos means that it's a candy filled with, filled with something inside. Okay, and so this is mango on the outside and it has chocolate on the inside. On the inside with a little bit of um, uh, chili flavor mm -hmm. outside. And this is like a um, peanut, peanut shape. Yeah, it is like a peanut shape. Mm -hmm. It's but really good. It's really good, it's hard. Mm, this is one of the candies that you chew, and you chew, mm -hmm. and you... <laughs> Eventually, you're gonna get inside. Mm, I'm hitting that spicy mm -hmm. a little bit. Mm. I don't know if I like that as much, but the mango is really good on the outside. So what would you rank this mm. from 1 to 10? For me, I would think 7. I was going to say the same. Mm -hmm. 7 because mm, I like it, but this is not one of my favorites. Mm -hmm. I'm like, mm, because I don't like to be... It's hard. Mm -hmm. And, um, you know, it, it kind of sticks to your teeth, yes. too. And, and I like to eat my candy pretty fast. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I can have more. <laughs> well, see, this is something I feel like I can only have one of. I can only eat one and then I'm kind of good. Oh, well, totally. Yeah, like I totally. can't have more than one. Like, no. like, I can't have another one. Exactly. So, it is good, but I think seven, mm -hmm. for sure. Okay, so next we're gonna be trying pelon, which is one of my favorites as a kid. I love this candy, and pelon means bald, and you will see why it means that. So excited, I haven't had these in a while. Yeah, this is definitely one of your favorites. Every yeah. time we went to Mexico, she had to have this. Yeah, I love these, these are so good. And this is like a little head, you know, like a little It's like shape. a little, yeah, it's like a little head, like a person, and see how it's like, the person's bald, right? And then you push it. And <laughs> here it goes. This has tamarind in it, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, which also, mm, most of the Mexican candy are made with fruit flavor. We love fruit. Mm -hmm. So um, this is tamarind, which is um, comes from a tree. It's a really unique flavor. Yes. It's like hair curls. Yeah. And then you make it bold. <laughs> <laughs> and you can do what my mom did is just take out the bottom and you just... get the desperate part yeah. because they're so good. <laughs> so what would you rank this candy? Mm. This is so popular. Mm-hmm. Mm. -hmm. mm. But see, it's not my favorite. Yeah. I think this is gonna be a nine for me. Okay, see, I would put this as like a 10 for me because I really, this was like my favorite. I loved it, I would eat it all the time. Yes. And it's also kind of fun. We have a mix of different lollipops and what types are they? Um, these are lollipops and of course, um, they are flavored with fruit which is um, fresh uh, watermelon, mm -hmm. mango, uh, and strawberry. And on top of it, it has chili powder. Okay, so these I are gonna be spicy for sure. <laughs> okay, should we try it? Yeah, let's try it. Which one are you trying? 
I like uh, probably um, mango. Of mango. Course. I'll try strawberry. And they have and they have the form of the fruit. Like, look, this is a strawberry, and they have like a little strawberry. And this is mango, and they have the form of mango. Mm. That's cute. Yeah. See, this is a mango, and that's a strawberry. And the uh, chili powder is powder on top. And you just. Mm. This just tastes like strawberry. It's like mango. Really? I don't really taste the chili powder. See? Let me try that one. This is good though. This just tastes like strawberry. I think I would try one now too. Oh yeah. Oh my God. That has the, the chili on it for sure. And these are very popular with kids. Because you know, we Mexicans love spicy. So we put chili powder and maybe mm -hmm. no yeah this is okay <laughs> well how would you rate that one probably like a four mm -hmm. okay. like i wouldn't i don't think i would eat this again okay but fair enough fair enough um what would you rate it i'll rate it um seven seven mm -hmm. seven even though i like it um and i can eat it um it just no one on my finger. Mm -hmm. No, yeah. Mm, I think this is for when you really get very um, spicy. This is kind of more sweet. That's more sweet, yeah. Okay, well, you can have the mango one, then I'll have the strawberry and watermelon. Sounds good to me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's not one of your favorites, though. Don't you glad it's not one of my favorites? <laughs> Okay, so the next candy we're gonna try is called Weenies, right? Right. right? Mm -hmm. And they're little cubes and they have caramel in it. Filled right? with caramel. Filled with caramel. Which another very popular um, candy, candy uh, in Mexico. We love caramel. It also says hot. Is it a little bit uh, I don't know. Uh, we're well, gonna see. You go for it. All right, <laughs> great. These are soft. Okay. I was wondering if you can chew on them. Mm -hmm. You can. I like these. They taste a lot like the other mango one we tried. Mm-hmm. You're right. Mm -hmm. These are soft. Mm-hmm. So you can chew these. The other ones, you suck more on them. Mm-hmm. On this one, you can chew. I think I like these better than the other ones. These are really good. I probably, these are probably like eight, eight and a half for me. I agree. Yeah. Eight for me as well. Mm -hmm. And I like chewing on candy rather than sucking on it. Yeah. Are you the same? Mm -hmm. Or are you like, it depends. I like both. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the next candy is called Royal de Guayaba. Is that how you pronounce That's it? That's how you said it, right? Okay, and it's a candy guava roll. So, this is one of your favorites, isn't it? It's my favorite. Yeah. If I go to the store and it happens for me, you know, to be walking in the aisle and I see that. You um, have to pick it up. I have to buy it. Okay. Let's try it. Let's see if it's as good as you say, Emma. Um, you can either use a knife and cut it, you know, but this is how, yeah, you can you just like tear just it. Just tear it. And it's like a roll, so if you see, you just get it from here. Oh. And it's there. Oh, there you go. Mm. And it has sugar, you know, under. Sugar all around all it. All around it. See, like when I see that, it makes, does it, I don't think it's fruit, like a fruit flavored. I think of like chocolate or like taffy or something. Mm -hmm. But it's weird, like eating it, and you get it's it's, really well. Yeah. It's wobbly really good. Sugar. Mm -hmm. It's really, oh, my favorite. That's your favorite? So is that a 10 I for you? I think it all today. This is a 10 for me. 10? Mm -hmm. For sure. I think it's like eight and a half, nine. Cause I feel like I'd get really sick of it. I, I couldn't eat all mm. of it, almost. Good. So it's all my <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, so we're gonna try another really popular Mexican candy called Duvaline. Um, this, I really like this as a kid as well. Um, and this one has three flavors. It has strawberry, vanilla, and hazelnut. And they have their own individual spoon. Mm -hmm. Where's the spoon? Where's the spoon? <laughs> There they are. Spoons. Would you eat it like? Uh, this is how I like to eat it. I like to mix it. Oh, you mix it? Okay. Yes. Ah, this is me. Mm. This is one of mine. Oh. Does it throw you back to your childhood? Yes. Totally. Yeah. And you used to eat this a lot yeah, too. Yeah, I remember. I really like these. Every time we go to Mexico, you want to go in. It's been a while though since I've had this. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, it's so good. It's like a, it's ice cream. It is, yeah. Right? It is. Well, Alex, what do you think? That's a 10 for me. It's a 10 I for really you. like it, yeah. What about you? My too. See, I already finished it. You finished it? Okay, hold <laughs> on. The spoon's too small, small for me. <laughs> <laughs> Can you bring one of the kitchen? You know, kitchen. <laughs> and just like that, it's gone. So this is definitely not ten. Really good. Let me just finish this really quickly. <laughs> <laughs> then we'll go to the next one. <laughs> mm -hmm. I can start another one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> but it's so good. Uh huh. They are good. Those are good. And we should put them like in a tray. Like, we should mm -hmm. in the fridge. And then we look at the bowl. This is Julie. <laughs> <laughs> so another dessert that's really popular in this family are benditos. These are so good. They are they're like cakes. They have um, a, a chocolate coating with strawberry and cream, like almost whipped cream inside. Um, these are so good and they're good when you put them in the fridge and they're cold. They're Let's try it. I'm very excited. I already know what this is. This is a 10 for me already. I don't need to try it, but I will just to make sure. Oh, and then we cut it in half and you see all this the mm -hmm. strawberry. Mm -hmm. So good because it's like the perfect balance of chocolate with some fruit and the cake. Well, you know, it's a tempo for both of us. Mm -hmm. So good. Okay, so the next candy we're gonna try is called Paleta Payaso. And as you can tell, Payaso means clown. And these are like chocolate covered marshmallow. Inside. Kind of yeah, mm -hmm. marshmallows inside, and um, it's covered with chocolate. So, oh yeah, I remember mm -hmm. that there was like jellies in the, uh -huh. in the face. In the face, like a face, and yeah. then it's, it's a marshmallow inside, like, see? It's good, but I don't think it's as good as like Gandito's to me. I think this is like an eight. Mm-hmm, not pretty. Yours is prettier. I know, yours got really messed up. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely an eight. Eight, right? We're gonna finish it, but it, it is an eight. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so last but not least, we have Bubulubu. Um, they are similar to the Payaso ones. They have marshmallow inside and it's covered in chocolate, but this has strawberry filling, filling. right? Mm -hmm. I don't think I like them that much. Mm -mm. Right? No. It is very sweet. It's really sweet. I mean, believe me, all of those candies are sweet. sweet. Yeah. It's not my favorite. Mm -mm. No. Her is my least favorite of yeah. all the candy that we... Do I think this is like a five. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah, it's just not that good. It's just, it's mm -hmm. okay. It's okay. Well, mine, obviously, the guava roll. That is, was your favorite? It's my favorite. And Gancito, of course. Mm -hmm. Um, in my least, um, this one. That one? Mm -hmm. For the last. For the best. No, my favorite was the pelon and um, 
the oh the duvalin oh the duvalin the duvalin that right. was so good yeah there you go Alex. there you go so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to give it a like and subscribe to see more content from me and i'll see you guys in my next video bye, bye everyone.